Let's take a little walk. More importantly about being a student. Orion's really hung up on that. Yeah. Oh, man. Wait, he's walking way too fast. Is this a race or something? Gimo, he's going to leave us behind. So she's a shorty. Dots. <laughs> You're so slow. Oh, my God. <laughs> you can't keep up with me being seven feet tall. <laughs> exactly. Where could he be going? That's... He's gonna push us in front of the train. Oh god. <laughs> Murder. Uh, does he not have anything to talk to you about? Emo, maybe you can say something. Wait, you shouldn't do that so carelessly. Slides. Dots. Oh man. Sixteen glasses. <laughs> The train station told you. Are we going to go somewhere on a train? You know this town. The cops have found me. <laughs> Dots. Dramatically. Oh, man. What? We're still walking? I'm so lazy, so... You're a spirit. You're not... Yeah, he's not even walking. He's floating. Why are you he floats. Dots. He's so dramatic. Hey, I kind of remember this place from when we were on our way here. Okay. Hmm? I don't know. I don't know what that means. Okay. Dots. Oh my god. So many dots. I would punch this guy in the face. He's just walking silently. Not saying a damn thing. <laughs> I wish people would just like walk and then occasionally say... Dots. Dots. <laughs> look back dramatically. Oh. Like, what does that mean? You want dipping dots? <laughs> I love dipping dots. Dots. <laughs> dipping dots. Oh, man. Ah, uh, isn't this pretty close to your house? Can he just be walking you home? Dots. <laughs> Yeah, we're back. So he really did walk you home. He's really unsociable, but maybe he's a gentleman at heart. You hate him, Orion. <laughs> Do you want to walk more? Uh, what? I'm not particularly interested in doing anything, but are you? If so, let me know. I don't even understand what he's talking about. <laughs> What was the point of all this power walking? For exercise? Who exercises anymore? God, we have cars and bikes <laughs> and... God, who needs to walk? <laughs> uh, no, he, he obviously walked you home. You just happen to be standing outside your house. Why did we walk all this way? It's not like my house is right behind Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for walking me home. I just asked you if you were interested <laughs> in doing it. anything and ah! you still want to walk more? Ah! What part of that would cause you to think that I was just walking you home? Oh god. <laughs> Darn it! <laughs> yeah, that is kind of... Uh, that's the first observant thing you've said so far, Ryan. Normally, if you walk with someone from the station to their house, you'd think they walked you home. In every anime, they're like, if you're walking someone home, they're like, walk her to the station. Or, go pick her up at the station. The station. I guess not to him. When I asked a friend what kind of actions newly dating couples should take, he told me to walk aimlessly around the station and such. Okay. I simply did as he said, but what meaning was there to this? <laughs> He's like an alien. You humans are odd. Weird. Uh, I'm pretty sure that your friend meant that you should go do things, like window shopping. 
I don't really understand how men and women should go about dating. Clearly. <laughs> Jake from Planet State Farm. <laughs> I know I'm repeating myself, but if you have any requests or complaints, I'd like you to tell me directly. Oh, man. Through HR. <laughs> when you fill out a complaint, and I'll get back to you. If there's nothing in particular you desire, I'll return to the university. I'll message you later. <laughs> uh, uh, he left. Hmm. This sure was a strange time. Oh, I almost went shin. <laughs> this sure was a strange time, man. Oh. He's gonna send a text message. Good night. Good night. <laughs> well, you know, we know for sure that Kent's your boyfriend and that you've only just started going out. He said you're his student, but he's too young to be a college professor. Maybe he tutored you or something. I thought like that, that said tortured. <laughs> Maybe he tortured you or something. <laughs> wow, that's and a he's leap. Like so happy about that's it. That's a leap. <laughs> <laughs> like a uh, yonder race simulator. <laughs> oh. There's no denying that he's a serious guy, though. And he's scary. <laughs> the issue is that he's too serious and he takes everything the wrong way. I'm sure he'd worry if. I'm sure he'd worry if you told him about your amnesia and. There's also pretty much a 100% chance that he'd take you to a hospital. At least there are no urgent problems to address. Let's just keep getting more information about you from him. Oh. <gasps> just gently click. Ah, oh, he's texting you already. Received a new message. Oh. You said you're not satisfied with just good morning and good night, so what else do you want me to write? Three. Oh. I don't know. It didn't do anything! I thought it might show us the other one. Hmm. It looks like he's taking your previous complaints pretty seriously. He's finally going through that mountain of paperwork you sent. <laughs> He's opening up the complaints <laughs> jar. <laughs> well, if the you before you... What? Oh. <laughs> well, if the you before you lost your memories really was in love with him, you probably wanted to hear some kinder words. Do we know if she was in love with him? I don't know. She didn't say... She doesn't did, seem very... She didn't like, say that, though. She, she didn't seem very hype about, like, hanging out with him. For example, things like, I want to see you, or I love you. I love you. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> hmm. Kermit the Frog here. Hmm, I guess the source of... <laughs> I guess the source of your fight really was these cold messages. Hmm. That really is a silly reason. You two are a couple, alright. Yeah. So, how do you think you want to reply to this message? Wow. You don't need to force yourself to text. So, just nothing from then on. Good morning. <laughs> Good night. Oh, well then. Diet. Goodbye forever. Okay, the logic part of me is like if we say good morning or good night or enough, he's like, well, why are we even freaking fighting then? But then he's like, you don't need to force yourself to text me. Like, oh my god, you like, I want you to want to text me. <laughs> and then you just start breaking stuff. <laughs> oh my god. I want you, you to, to want to I do want the dishes. I want you to stop setting a reminder <laughs> to text me every day and night. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to turn off the burner that you have automatically <laughs> set to send good night and good morning. <laughs> what you want should we do? Uh, I guess the top. <laughs> I gotta be like that really girly voice, but be mean. <laughs> yeah. You don't need to force yourself to text me. 
Jeez. <laughs> he texts really fast, though. No. No! I, I understand. I'll stop sending you messages, then. <laughs> Is... This was an unnecessary action on my part, and a waste of valuable time. Wow. It will really help not... Oh, no! Oh, right. <laughs> having to send these. <laughs> Starting tomorrow, I won't text you unless I have specific business to discuss, so don't worry. Oh, crap. <laughs> no. We messed up. Oh, no. I don't want to look at our... <laughs> Whoa! He just sent you a surprisingly long message! We should just send tell him to not text you some more. <laughs> then he'll text you all the time. Yeah. Did he take it as something like, I don't want your pity messages? Please just stop. <laughs> I think so. Let's see. Anyway, it looks like we found a somewhat solid source of information. That's more than enough for today. Ooh. It's gonna be like low. Okay. Trust is so low. <laughs> no. Oh crap. Okay. Hope we can get that back up. <laughs> Gotta save scum. Um I already said that. <laughs> He's pretty weird, but at the very least, he doesn't seem like a bad person. It'd be good to stay in contact with him. The day might even come when he'll listen to a ridiculous story like, You have a spirit possessing you and not make fun of you. Yeah, the chances of that can't possibly be zero. No. He'll just adjust his glasses and say, Duh. Hmm, I see. Mm, yes, of course, indeed. <laughs> That's what he does in the anime, though. Indubitably. When they confess, he's just like, all nonchalant. Hmm, I see. It's okay, don't worry. I'm sure your memories will come back. And I'll be with you until then. And then I die. <laughs> I die forever. <laughs> Please don't remember. It hurts when you remember. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Tomorrow, we should do a full search of your room. We didn't get a chance to check everything today. But for now, you're pretty tired, because we walked 10,000 miles. Yeah. So, let's just get some rest. Oh. Ah, look, it's you. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, my glasses. <laughs> uh, <laughs> August 2nd. Dun, dun, dun. Wait a minute, what's that? What? Flip back a page in the notebook you're looking through. Don't tell me what to do. My own woman. <laughs> Look, the stuff written here is your schedule for August. I wonder what these red circles on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday of each week mean. If we think about it, normally things that happen on the same days every week would be a part-time job or club activities, right? For example, let's say this is a schedule of your club activities. Clubs usually have many members. You'd know everyone there, and they'd expect you to show up. I with barely them. knew people in the uh, exactly. clubs in high school. A club, every club member that I know is like, Ugh, I knew those people were going to show up. <laughs> if you don't show up and don't say anything on those days, they'll start to wonder why you're gone and come looking for you. I doubt I, it. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> Let's see, today is Tuesday. The next red circle is on Thursday, so we have two days, not including today. Okay, it's been decided. We can do math, okay? <laughs> we figured out the yen, okay? It would be a problem if we don't figure out what this is and prepare for it. For now, the only possible leads for information are the three people we know you knew before losing your memories. That includes your boyfriend, Kent, and also the <laughs> servers who seemed to know you at the cafe yesterday. I'm just gonna say that every time. It seemed like you weren't going out for long, but Kent <laughs> is your boyfriend, so 
So maybe we should go to him first. <gasps> He's calling. <gasps> oh my god. Uh, are you, do I have to click? I don't want to, <laughs> you know, click on accident. Okay. What? He's got really great timing. This guy is good. No, he's not. Sir. Sir. This is perfect. Look for a good opportunity to get information of your plans out of him. You aren't coming to them? Oh, no. What? You don't have work today. Let me guess. You're still angry about the day before yesterday? Yes. <laughs> yes, I'm so mad about your Aww. I'll apologize again if you want. I'm sorry about that day. Poor guy. So, are you not going to come today? Uh, wait. Did you have some sort of plans to meet Kent today? He said you don't have work today. So that means you had a, uh, a custom of meeting on days when you didn't have work. And wait, work? Are those circles in your notebook work days? This is really bad. You don't remember anything? It's called amnesia. Dude. <laughs> of course Like, you how long does it take to... How insensitive of him. <laughs> He's just like, you don't remember anything? Oh my god, god you're why so not? Stupid. Dumb. What should we do? Is there any way of getting him to tell you about your job? Then we could figure out what to do beforehand. What's wrong? Do you have plans? Totally. Oh, God. What? Why, why are we talking about um, work? It's not a work day, is it? <laughs> yeah, it's not. What? Luella! <laughs> do you want to meet me at my work that I don't have today? Or would you like to walk me to work and then just stand outside because we don't have work today? Oh god. I, uh. No, send back good morning. <laughs> Just say good morning because they're on the phone. <laughs> Hang up. <laughs> oh man. Uh, dip, dip, dip. Yes. Alright, now we can make mistakes. Yes. Alright. Walk to work. Yeah, I think that would be the best. Would you like to take a walk to my work? <laughs> What? what? <laughs> no. <laughs> ah. You didn't seem to be enjoying our walk yesterday, but did you find it agreeable <laughs> after the fact? <laughs> My cows are killing me, but yeah. <laughs> uh. No, it wasn't. Having a power walking race isn't agreeable. Well, as you know, taking walks is my daily routine, so I don't consider it an unsuitable proposition. Okay. <laughs> However, you desire to go to your workplace on a day <laughs> off? That's quite commendable in a way. Okay, sounds good so far. <laughs> you were just there yesterday, after all. What? Ah, I see. I'm sure you forgot something at the cafe yesterday. Wow, he thinks I'm forgetful. <laughs> You believed that I'd make fun of you if you told me, and so you tried to come up with a reason to go. Uh, let's go with that. Am I correct <laughs> to assume this? You never appeared to have any issues with blonde honesty, so this level of thought is unusual. I find this perplexing. <laughs> <laughs> He's human. Spock. He's Spock. Just like, I don't understand. These human customs of yours. I don't have emotions. <laughs> What is emotion? <laughs> However, perhaps you may have heard this. A wise man once said, inadequate ideas are worse than none at all. Gandhi. I'm just kidding, I don't know. <laughs> Confucius say. Confucius say. <laughs> man who go to bed with the chibot wake up with a stinky finger. Uh, so, to sum it up, the cafe yesterday is where you work. Awesome, thanks. It's actually pretty lucky that we found out where you work, and we only got made fun of a little in exchange. Oh. But I see now. That's the reason why the waiters knew your name and recognized you. It's really funny. I, it usually lights up. 
Now then, what should I do? I'm appreciative of the offer, but I'd like to continue progress in my research. My research? Yes. To take over the world? The world will be mine. <laughs> what? I thought he was saying you should meet today. Once I figure out how to keep these glasses on my head, <laughs> I will rule the world. <laughs> If your insensitive idea is correct, it could go to retrieve your forgotten item, then come here. If my insensitive idea is correct, you can just go. I don't get it. See, he knows he's being insensitive. Wow. <laughs> he's, he's like, if my insensitive idea is correct. Wow. <laughs> There's enough time for that. For what? I don't know. <laughs> I'm strange. <laughs> Wait a minute! Yeah, me- yeah, I'm with you, Orion. <laughs> he said, come here! Here, but where? Ken's house? We don't know! He's at the university. And if possible, it would be best to have tea or something at work and watch what they're doing. Hmm. What will you do, Gimo? How will you answer him? That sounds really weird. I want to watch them. <laughs> observe their movements. <laughs> See them in their natural in habitat. habitat. Right <laughs> now. Right here we have servers in their natural habitat. You have me. Saves coming. Yes. So <laughs> I, If I do this, he's going to be like, hmm. That's really intriguing. <laughs> That's really crappy. I wanted of you to, to watch do. the servers at the cafe. Mm, I also like to watch people do random things. <laughs> Let's talk more on this subject. <laughs> He's such a weird guy. Okay, I save, so we're fine. I, I want to watch. Ba, ba, ba. Okay. Uh, so Trust the went up the, a little bit. It's the end of the W. Yeah. That's kind of like confiding in him, though. But um, I got that. It's because I don't feel confident. But then he might be like, "You work at a cafe." <laughs> <laughs> like, what's not to be confident about? You work at a cafe. I don't know how to make lattes right. <laughs> <laughs> it's because I don't feel confident. Do it. Do it. We'll see what he says. Uh, okay. It's because I don't feel confident in my work. <laughs> my very important work. What your work <laughs> skills? It's been four months since you started. How bad are you at learning? God. You're such a How shit are you that you can't make a latte after four months? Did you make a mistake? Ooh. Regardless, all you have to do is ask if you can borrow your normal work manual and come here when you're finished. Mm -hmm. See you later. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> <laughs> good morning, good night. Good afternoon. <laughs> what? Ah, no! I thought it went up. I don't know if it did anything. It... It went down a little tiny little bit. It went down? Trust. I thought you said it was at, at the, the end, W. At the end of the W, but like it was more at the end of the W. Like it t went down a tiny bit, I think. I'm not sure. <sighs> I'm blind. I know. I <laughs> when I was doing the shin playthrough, I had to like, like, oh god, did it go down? I don't know. And I kept just playing it over and over again. Which one was the right one? Um, let's see what this one does. This guy's difficult. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I had to save scum everything. I want to watch. I wanted to watch the servers at the cafe like a weirdo. Uh huh. Yes. <laughs> right. An interesting idea. You wish to observe people, <laughs> or do you wish to observe your coworkers at work? Oh man. Or perhaps you'd like to experience the atmosphere of your workplace as a customer, in order to better serve them in the future. What is this the right answer? That's a very interesting way of thinking. Oh, come on. Yeah, well, that sounds agreeable. Is he gonna come to the cafe? While you're there, no. you can borrow a manual and compare the two. You could also note an inconsistencies within the manual. 
Once you're done, I can meet you here as usual. Okay. See you later. Good night, good morning. <laughs> Guten Tag. Guten Tag. Hi. Yes. Oh, it went up. Yes. Yeah. We're masters of this game. <laughs> so just be a weirdo. <laughs> yeah. Okay. He just said what he wanted and then hung up. But borrowing a work eh, but borrowing a work manual is a really good idea. I didn't even know they had one. All right, let's go to Mado no Hitsuji. Oh, why can't we just like go to your work? Go to the place. With go the to stuff. the place with the maids and stuff. Welcome back, Ma. Mom. <laughs> Mom. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> oh, it's you. Oh. I noticed this yesterday too, but this guy seems really antisocial. Don't you think? Is it really okay for a butler to be like this? Uh, I don't know. There's an event in the moonshine room today. It's a full house. Huh? Oh, he's right. The cafe is full of people today. Wait, moonshine room? Is everyone getting pissed on <laughs> moonshine? <laughs> They're White going lightning blind. room. They're going the blind. Mountain Dew room. <laughs> In that case, as a staff member, it probably wouldn't be good to take up a seat. Dots. <laughs> Fancy though. Dots. <laughs> Ow. I don't think it might matters. Might want to get the manual, people. yeah. Because your dude might. Kent might ask about, where's that manual I told you to get <laughs> about your research and blah blah blah. But he might be like, you don't know your job, you're fired. <laughs> A okay. manual. Ah. Last week you forgot to give a customer a teaspoon. A teaspoon. A teaspoon. A teaspoon. I didn't know. What? You weren't here last what? week. Dots. <laughs> Your desire to learn is admirable. <laughs> As the manager, I'll permit you to take the manual with you. That smile, oh my god. <laughs> Creeper. <laughs> ah, so this person's the manager. And that's what it's gonna pop up as his name tag too. Manager. <laughs> Duh. Here is the manual. Dance. I guess we should thank him. I guess. I guess. <laughs> I reckon we should thank this gentleman right here. I do. Yeah. <laughs> he just nodded and left. He seemed almost like a ghost. <laughs> <laughs>